Do you know why you're in my office today? I do. I can't believe my brother would do such a thing. Well, just so you know, he will be held responsible even though he's still a freshman. Okay. Hey there, world. It's Blue Girl, back here at my blog, and I can't believe you guys fell for that. Like Ellie would ever do such a thing, but I still couldn't believe that her brother did it, or that this whole thing even happened in the first place. I can't believe that this happened. Me neither. You know who probably put him up to it? Jane. She probably pressured him into making the video. You're probably right. Wish there was something we could do. Hello, ladies. Vera, I need you on stage to go over the flower seed. And Daisy, I need you to help Scott with the set. And what did I say about sitting in my chair? What? I wanted to sit down. You weren't sitting here, so... Ah, uh, what are we to do with you? So as you might know, there's this thing on Earth called Halloween, and Daisy took me to get some costumes for this holiday. Good thing we came on a weekday. Yeah, there's practically no one here. We have the store to ourselves! Yeah, so let's get to shopping. Now this is a good costume. Are you sure? I feel like my head is too big. You mean bigger than usual? Hey! Just teasing you. Ha ha. Come on, let's go. I became really excited for our school's Halloween party on Halloween night. Ellie was telling me all about it at lunch the other day. I'm really glad you're coming. I'm excited! It'll be my first Halloween party. Well, not to brag, but we threw the best costume party in town. Um... Um, can I help you? Vera, it's me. The guy who made the video. Ellie's brother. Oh my goodness! What is it? I'm really sorry about it. Everything I did, it wasn't really up to me, though. Somebody blackmailed me into doing it, and I think you know who. Of course I knew who it was. We all knew who it was. The spawn of the evil one herself. I just couldn't believe Jane was on her tricks again. Blackmailing little boys into doing her dirty work? How evil can she get? I knew it. She's so predictable. I just wish she would stop, and I wish we had some evidence. Don't worry. One day, we'll be out of her evil clutches. But for now, we're gonna have to deal with her. Unfortunately, Daisy was right, but I couldn't stop thinking about getting my sweet revenge. But soon, Halloween came. And it was time for the, all the spooky ooky fun. Where are all the decorations? Our school's pretty cheap. They only decorate one section of the courtyard. Want me to show you the spooky section? Ooh! <laughs> okay, Daisy, I think I've seen enough. Let's go now. Aw, oh, come on, Garly. Not afraid of a little spooky, are you? Huh, what's over there? Over where? Daisy? Daisy? And I thought I was alone. But really... Ah! Oh, it's just you guys. Hey, Brad. Hey, Ellie. Hey, Bear. What are you doing out here by yourself? Yeah, it's awful spooky out here. Uh, I kind of lost Daisy. 
But I'm good now. Oh, Daisy, yeah, we saw her up ahead. You could come join us if you want. But me and Ellie were planning to go up to Couples Peak. In your dreams, you skis. Nah, I'm good. I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Part of me wishes that I actually did go with my friends to the main part of the courtyard because when I went up to Couples Peak just to see the view, I saw something way more disturbing. Hey there. Not much of a talker, huh? Hey, listen, I know you're a total stranger, but uh, I need some advice. There's this girl that I really like, but I've played so many games with her that I don't know if she'll take me back. What should I do? Um, um, I think you should ask her out. Maybe she'll take you back. Okay, thanks. You really helped me a lot. Roger? You wanted to meet me here? Excuse us, I have to go take care of something. Jane? Yes, Roger? I wanted to tell you that... You're annoying, selfish, and not very nice. But after thinking it through and talking it out with some people... I realized that despite these things, I like you. So I'm just gonna cut to the chase. Will you be my girlfriend again? OMG! Yes, yes, yes! I thought he was talking about me. I couldn't stand the embarrassment and got out of there. Who knows what really happened up there? Wait a second, something didn't feel right. What could you possibly mean? I've made a terrible mistake. I actually love Farah. It's no matter what happened up there. For the rest of the night, everyone was having fun. But I couldn't get Roger off my mind. I thought I was over him. That night I couldn't go to bed. My mind was awake, filled with too many thoughts. Why are you up so late, Blueberry? I want to go home. But you are home. No, I want to go back to Glabnar. Well, I was saving this for the holidays, but... If you're homesick, I don't see why we can't make a little visit. So it looks like I'm going to visit my hometown. More reports next time.